pretty girl can walk anywhere. All doors open for her. Good evening from chilly Melbourne. Like a breath of fresh air. Like a breath of fresh air. Her beauty. Her beauty. It proceeds. It proceeds her. How you going, guys? Girls? Kids? Hope you're doing fine out there. Um, it's a bit chilly down here in Melbourne. I was just outside, just a little rugged up. Um, and yeah, big day down here in Melbourne. The most uh, cases that have ever been reported in one day, anywhere in this beautiful country of ours. Yeah, um, I don't know if you got a chance to see Dan today, but uh, he was, uh, Oh, he was dealing with it as well as he can, you know. I don't, I don't know how he does it as a head of uh, the state. He had to, you know, the reporters were like a pack of animals attacking him. And he had to, like, say, settle down. I'll answer your questions. If you want me to stay here for two hours, I'll do it. Settle the fuck down. Put a fucking mask on. Settle down. Um, yeah, he was really... Um, put them in their place. Um, everybody wanted answers, but uh, they kept asking the same questions. And, uh, you know, uh, he gave them the answers. You know, there's a lot of people that are um, taking a big hit as of midnight tonight. You can feel it in the streets, you can feel it in the shops. Not that I went in that many shops, but you just feel it, you know. That people are uh, walking on, on eggshells again, you know. And I, I feel for the people that have lost their jobs. And uh, I hope um, our darling government takes care of everybody. Um, the other big news coming out of Beirut today. I'm sure you all saw that footage. That's what I woke up to this morning when I turned on the, my phone and looked at the news. I was like, when I was just in shock at what I saw. Um, what I really liked is the president was like, you know, of Lebanon, you know, saying that, you know, 2,750 tons of ammonium nitrate, you know, shouldn't have been stored in an insecure place. He said it was unacceptable. Well, he's the president of the country. So somebody's going to have to figure that one out. That's really fucking horrible. And probably the biggest news today, um, you know, the borders from here to New South Wales are basically shut to car traffic unless you're on a border town. And, um, you know, I'm not in a border town, so it looks like I'm going to be here for at least lockdown. And who knows where that's going to go. But just in case, you know, I have, I have gotten myself ready. You know, the rules do not apply man with a gun. So if I do have to get over the border, if I do have to get out of here, I'm going to shoot my way out. I'm going to make sure that whatever happens, somebody is going to go down with me. And um, it could get ugly. It's getting ugly here anyway. Just because you have to look at me. But I'm armed and I'm definitely dangerous. So I hope you're all having a wonderful Wednesday evening, which feels like Tuesday, which feels like every other day. Maybe not where you are, but here it certainly does. Um, I did go in and uh, get myself cleaned up today. Not my face, but uh, I got rid of the curls um, because uh, no more haircuts for six weeks and I was looking out of control already. And I did that once before when we were back in March and I didn't get a haircut. Even though the barbers were open, I was like, mm, I'm not going to go in there. Didn't think it was a good idea to sit next to somebody who'd seen X amount of people in a day. So, I'm the man with a gun. I hope you're having a wonderful evening. And all I got to say is what's so funny about peace, love, and understanding. I'm not a gun sort of guy. So, I miss you all. Love goes out to all of you, wherever you may be. And um, keep the faith down here in Victoria. 
My love goes out to uh, Egg and Greta and their family as his business has been shut down now. Um, so he's going to be on a long holiday, which is uh, a little disappointing because I see him a few times a week. So I don't know if that's going to continue at all. But we'll see where that goes. I'll probably see him tomorrow and have a glass of wine and have a chat. Um, yeah, it's funny being down here in Victoria and not seeing the family that I, that I love down here. So, um, big hugs for all of you. Stay calm, stay clear, stay loving, don't react, and um, wear a fucking mask. It's probably not a bad idea. Take good care of yourselves. I'll catch you on the flip side.